first, police stop a trio of burglars right in their tracks. How one of them tried to get away from officers. Good evening, everyone. I'm Kim Gable. Police got the call around 3 o'clock this morning. End of the crime, a house in the South Side Flats. They found at least three people trying to break in. Lisa Washington has our top story. We spoke with the owner of the home where that early morning home invasion happened. She says she was fearful when she heard banging on the doors. She believes the suspects were there because of drug activity. According to police, the suspects were in a silver was parked outside the home in the 100 block of South 21st Street. Police arrested a 20-year-old woman, an 18-year-old, and a 15-year-old. One of the suspects reportedly had a gun. That male, they observed him take a black t-shirt and a golden towel and throw it in the car. They saw him discard a handgun underneath the car and then he proceeded to turn and run. I'm afraid I have grandchildren. I have great grandchildren. This woman owns the home where the invasion happened. She believes it happened because one of her tenants may be involved in drugs. It's all over drugs because they ripped them off and they found out where they lived. And it happened to be my home. They didn't take anything. They just told us to get on the ground, run, rummaged around. Josh Smith lives in the home. He says the suspects were there because it was retaliation after a fist fight. I, uh, down the hotel side, I got into an altercation with him, and I was with my baby, and he disrespected me and my baby, so I, I beat him up, and then he said he was going to come back. Pittsburgh police are continuing their investigation. They're still looking for a third man who was involved. The three suspects who were arrested faced charges of robbery, burglary, and criminal conspiracy. Reporting on the Southside Flats, Lisa Washington, KDKA TV News.